Language can be one of the greatest barriers, but Google is smashing it down with advancements in its live translate feature. It can translate text messages, closed captions, real world text, and even live conversations all in real time. All you need is a Pixel 6 or newer, and it also works only in certain languages. And you can learn more about that in our dedicated post, which is linked in the description below. If you have one of these Google phones though, here's how to take advantage of live translate. First, you gotta turn it on. So if you go to settings and then go to system, you tap on live translate right here, select it, and then make sure that's turned on. Also make sure to add the languages that you wanna use. In my case, it'll be Spanish because it's the other language I know. First, we're gonna try to use it on the messages app. I have this conversation that I created that is not working because I don't have a SIM card on this phone, but you'll still be able to experience it. Usually the little translate chip will show up around here, but I can trigger it by pressing holding on the message and then tapping copy. It'll ask me if I wanna translate the copy text, right? And that'll pull up the options right there. Um, it was, yeah, hola is like, hi, hello, hi there. Uh, if you want more options, you can also tap on this menu button right here and you can do it, set it up so that it does the translations automatically and you get more options right here. You can also translate all the messages in the chat, which is pretty cool. So if you tap here, it'll translate everything I had right there. This is the original language. Hola, como estas? And then you put it in English. Hi there, how are you? Now, if you wanna translate closed captions, this is pretty cool because it works with any video or audio that you're consuming on your phone. We're gonna test it with YouTube though, just to make things simple. I have this video from Marta Gareda and Jordi Rosado and they speak Spanish, right? And we're gonna test it with this one. So once you're playing a video, you can turn on closed captions by pressing either of the volume buttons and then tapping on the little closed caption button right there. You turn it on and it'll start showing you the closed captions around here, right? There it is. And now you get this option right here to translate to English, which if you tap on it, it'll start translating it live. Feel anything, nothing comfortable. And lately the truth is that blah, 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 blah. And now everything here will be in English and you can switch to Spanish if you want. You can go back to English. You, you also get more options. But yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. One really cool feature is that you can translate text in real life using the phone's camera, right? And to do that, all you have to do is press on the Google Lens um, button right here in the search bar. And now you tap on translate. And now you can point the camera at any text in any other language and it'll show you on the screen live what the text says. Here's a really cool one. You can actually translate voice in person using interpreter mode, which is a way to communicate with people in real life, right? So all you have to do is say, okay, Google, turn on interpreter mode. Got it. What language do you want translated? Spanish. Let's put the volume up. How are you? ¿Cómo estás? Bien, ¿y tú? Good, and you? I'm real good. I just came out of work and I want to go grab a beer. Do you want to come with me? Estoy muy bien. Acabo de salir del trabajo y quiero ir a tomar una cerveza. ¿Quieres venir conmigo? Pretty awesome, if you ask me. So now Babbel has nothing on you. You can use your phone to translate whatever you wish, whether it is on your phone or in the real world. See ya.